destination mark. Hey guys, how's it going? Marcelo here. And uh, first and foremost, I am very tired. Uh, work took a lot out of me, so I was napping. And then this drop happened. Um, now actually, this drop, I didn't have anything to do with it, but I was kind of involved in a little bit of a thingy where stuff was happening with Debbie Derryberry talking about Coco like last night slash early this morning. So let me tell that story real quick. So, um, first, <laughs> uh, last night Debbie just randomly is like, oh, hey, uh, if you're not following me on Instagram, you should do that. And, and really, you guys should do that. So link down below to her Instagram. Uh, and I just responded with, okay, because I just wanted to respond. I'm like, I should do that. And she liked the tweet and whatever, and then like one other guy down below me <coughs> goes, hopefully, she, he, he puts, he ats me and her, and he's like, hopefully you're, you come back as Coco in the Crash remakes. She responded <laughs> uh, early this morning to that tweet with, I sure am. <laughs> and I was like, oh, uh, whoa, 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 Debbie. Please, Debbie Derryberry, please, uh, did you just straight up confirm that you're Coco? And, um, nothing else on that. Nothing throughout the rest of the day. So that was before I went to work, early, early in the morning. And I was like, oh, now I have to sit on this for like five hours until I come back and then see if anything's been updated. And when I did come back, nothing was updated. So I was like, oh God, she's straight kind of like, it's still kind of a tease, but even I put to that to that tweet, to her tweet, I, I commented back like, ooh, no uh, hints or teases or anything, just straight confirmation. Uh, she didn't respond to that or like it or anything like that, so I was like, yeah, she's probably gonna say anything for a while. Um, <coughs> then she straight up comes out and says, I have a big announcement to make. And then after that one, she goes, when should I make the announcement? And then she put like a little poll of like 2 p.m., 3 p.m., 4 p.m. Of course everyone chose the, the earliest time, 2 p.m. So, um, earlier today at 2 p.m., I actually woke up like a half hour later. So I'm still all groggy and everything. But I looked over to see, because I, I looked over at my clock to see what time it was. It was like 2.30. So I immediately hopped on a Twitter on my iPod and there it is. There it was. She confirmed it. It's official. Dippy Dairy Berry is back as Coco. Now... It seems like, you know, no surprise, right? She's been Coco since Breath of Cortex, like over a decade ago. Now, that's not where the surprise is. Where the surprise is, is the fact that she just straight up said it. She confirmed it on Twitter, and look at what Lex Lane did when he was bouncing around the subject of like, well, I'm working on some new, I have some new voiceover roles. Uh, I've been told I'm gonna reprise some certain characters. One of them's a doctor. And then one of them's a yada yada, and then another one's a yada yada. So like, he was trying to dance around it, and when people immediately thought that Doctor was Cortex, which we were right, he was like, oh guys, no, it's not Cortex, uh, but it'd be cool if I haven't gotten the call, but that'd be cool. No, he, he was dancing around it. He, obviously, he's Cortex again, so. No, Debbie just straight confirmed it. She's Coco. <laughs> so, um, that's fucking awesome. I'm so glad that she just, she just said it. <laughs> so, I think that's really cool. Um, with that being said, who else do you think we can get? Uh, we already know that Maurice LaMarche is Brio, Lex Lane is Cortex, Jess Harnell is Crash. We have not heard an official confirmation that Greg Eagles will be on Kowaku in the remasters just because he was him in uh, Skylanders Imaginators. But yes, Coco's going to be, because we, for some reason, because we haven't seen characters like uh, Coco and Dimwood Dial and Tiny Tiger, um, I don't know why for Coco specifically, people thought she wasn't going to be in the 2 and 3 remasters. And I'm like, uh, she kind of has to, especially for warps. She has levels dedicated to her, um, and a boss battle. So, um, I had no doubt in my mind that the Coco character was still going to be in this remaster. There's no way you can't have Coco in this remasters. And, um, there was no doubt in my mind it was going to be David Derryberry. It was just a matter of, will she confirm it? Will someone else, you know, Vicarious Visions confirm it? Who's going to confirm it? And who's going to confirm it first? David Derryberry. So, um, who else do you think? So that's really all I wanted to say. If you guys just haven't heard the news on Twitter, um, and trust me, it, if it hasn't heard yet, it's going to spread. You know, at the time that I'm recording this, 
she sent the confirmation like a little over or under an hour ago. So, um, what do you guys think of this news? Um, it's fucking awesome, in my opinion. So, um, <coughs> what other voice actors do you feel should be coming back for other characters? Like, we have to get a Dino Dial. Um, we just haven't seen him yet. We're, of course, going to be getting Tiny Tiger. Um, a lot of people are saying that John DiMaggio would be cool. To, you know, it would be a good choice to have uh, Henry Price his role as Tiny since he was him in Crash Natural Kart. Crash Natural Kart's a VV game. That makes sense. Um, who was it? Uh, what was his name? Dwight Schultz as uh, Dingo Dial would be cool. He was him in Natural Kart. That would make sense. Um, especially if you go on Dwight Schultz's IMDb page. When you look at a lot of Crash voice actors, IMDb pages, that aren't the big ones, like Jess Harnell, David Derry Bear, and all of them, uh, some of, a lot of them seem to have slipped into obscurity, but uh, of the ones that were like Corey Burton, and um, I think even Corey Burton might still, I haven't even seen his IMDb, but maybe he's still doing stuff uh, to this day. Uh, Michael Enzyme as Entropy would be cool. Um, and I think he's still he's still definitely doing stuff to this day. Uh, he has like some actually super modern projects, and it's rumored on there that he might be coming back as um, Entropy. So that'd be cool. Dwight Schultz, I think, is definitely still doing stuff uh, to this day. So I mean, they're not in in obscurity; they're still doing stuff. So if they can uh, be contacted to come back as these characters, they're like some of the best ones for these you know, choices for these characters. Nolan North as Engine. Um, it, I think Quentin Flynn is still doing stuff, and he was a pretty okay engine. Um, but if Nolan North comes back as engine, he's going to, of course, have to, you know, change it up. He can't just be the insane, crazy-ass engine as he is in the Radical games, because that's not this kind of engine. So, um, all in due time left to see, but as it stands right now, we've got yet another voice actor confirmed for the remasters. It's Debbie, Debbie Derryberry as Coco. So that's awesome. What do you guys think of this? Let me know in the comments below. I'm Marcelo. I'll see you guys later. I'm going back to bed. Take care.